Hey, it's Carson from Amateur Volkswagen. Just want to give you a quick tour of our 2020 Volkswagen E-Golf. Just about to show you here shortly. So this right here is our 2020 Volkswagen E-Golf. E-Golf being the elect fully electric version you can get on the Golf here. They did stop producing these cars, so they can't get them anymore. The only thing you can get is pre-owned versions of these. This one's pretty good condition. No port accidents, one owner two as well. Um, roughly around, I'll show you the mileage later on, but pretty good shape for 2020 here. So. Headlights over here, full LED. Uh, this one does come with the technology package and also driver assistance package, so all the safety features. I'll show you that inside in the interior here. It's nice about the e-golf, you get this blue little strip uh, across the whole grill here, even in your headlights. More e-golf badging there, and also your Volkswagen badging as well. So this does come with daytime run lights. It's kind of unique design for the e-golfs here. Uh, it's literally kind of stripped like that here. So when the daytime, daytime run lights are on, it's gonna look pretty nice too as well. It's in Reflex Silver. Reflex Silver is a nicer version of the, in my opinion, better than the silver that we have right now on our vehicles. They are currently on winters. Tire trendy is still pretty good. It does come with a second set of tires. Um, that's what the previous owner mentioned, so we are receiving those shortly. These are 16 inches specific. More e-golf badging on the side there. Again, being the Golf is, is the hatchback version, so perfect for just daily driving, highway driving too as well. Do the keyless entry on driver and passenger side does kind of have this little aftermarket so you don't scratch your thing but we can take it off as well and also for hitting doors and also your covers on the windows too as well it does have a blind spot sensor on both side mirrors what a lot of orange whenever a vehicle is beside you front and rear parking sensors as well moving to rear iconic uh rear end for the golfs here e-golf badging on the left side again with the rear parking sensors as well the hov bat uh, sticker right there what's nice about e-golfs and also all the golfs their backup cameras actually integrated into the badge so it's going to flick up whenever you go in reverse just so it doesn't get dirty or everything here too as well here open the trunk flick it in pull it up good amount of space in here obviously being a hatchback you don't get ton amount of space but perfect as just any grocery shopping and you are able to fold those seats down for a little bit extra space this one does come with the net too as well and also the privacy cover here so passenger side is going to be not much different than the driver side there's a little scrape uh, just right here otherwise the charger is on the right side here for this it is a level one charger and then this pull this right here it is your level two charger too as well i do recommend a level two charger whenever you buy an electric vehicle reason why is level one charger you can be charging in 48 hours level two charger safer uh, at night time to charge it within seven eight hours depending on what kind of car it is too as well but um a little bit easier too as well but back seat space good amount of back seat space in here again we just got this in literally 10 minutes ago so it doesn't need a little detail it does come with cup holders and armrests two vents in the back obviously the leatherette so it's titan black leatherette that's what the seats are called so it's synthetic leather on that part passenger side does come with power recliner by the way it's manual adjusting seats it does come with the e golf uh, rub, uh, rubber mats as well power locks power windows obviously with storage compartment for your drinks and other stuff here too moving on to the main part of the vehicle the driver's side so driver's side same thing uh power recliner otherwise manual adjusting seats interior does come with the metal polished pedals a little bit nice bonus too mirror controls here does have heated mirrors all you have to do is switch to this setting right here light settings here and also you win the controls here so interior wise turn the car on so it's also going to turn off the car for you when you step out the vehicle too but push start right there it does come with the leather at steering wheel pretty nice feeling blue stitching here too as well your digital cluster so it's a the fancier version you can go in with the technology package has 13,683 kilometers not bad for 2020 at all. Again, with the max charge, you're roughly getting around 200 ish on a full charge there. With the digital cluster, you can kind of change different views, everything with the right side of your steering wheel here. Also, has voice control, all that stuff, and then buttons for media. It does have adaptive cruise control, safety assist systems, has lane assist, blind spot monitor, rear traffic alert, and front autonomous braking. Front autonomous braking would actually save you 10% on insurance, which is nice to have too, as well. With this technology package, you do get big screen too. So it does have Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and also Bluetooth. So you can choose here, home, whatever you on personal preference here. Click that, show you the integrated navigation here. So a little bit nicer to have. And if we're going to vehicle here, see all that stuff. You can literally play with the infotainment screen however you want here. 
but show you all that here. So this transmission here, you do get your dual climate control settings here. It does come with heated seats on driver and passenger side. It's no speed or technically a one speed for electric cars, uh, what they call it. So it's kind of a one gear. You, that's why you do get the instant torque when you floor these cars, but your back camera's right there. Presses menu button, shows your front and rear parking sensors as well. But you do get drive mode, B mode is kind of the regenerative braking. So whenever you lift off the gas, it's gonna kind of break for you to save a little bit extra um, charge here. But push start, got different drive modes, normal, eco and eco plus. That's how park assist here and also push the button for your parking sensors. E-Golf badging here. These are front wheel drive vehicles as well. So um, obviously perfect for in the snow. They do have an electronic differential or a kind of, so you do get two fr true front wheel drive with both wheels spinning here. Electronic parking brake, two cup holders here. And also tiny center console for just fitting small things in there. Pop this open, does have USB for Apple CarPlay and everything there. But that'd be a majority of our 2020 Volkswagen e-golf. So thank you for watching my quick video walk around on our 2020 Volkswagen e-golf. Have any questions, come on and book an appointment for a test drive. Give me a call or text back at my direct number at 604-832-8768. Talk to you soon. Bye now.